Frederick Ground Racing reached the final, 6.5 metres, and they're on their way, two well away with one, and it's Trap 2 live rather narrowly from Trap 1. They're followed by 5, 4, 6, very wide, 3 somewhere drift early doors, but Live Lauren has escaped the attentions of Swiper, though, who is showing good middle pace, just had to check there, Swiper, 2 clear of 1 now, followed by 6 on the outside, then comes 5, 4, Space Jet is playing catch up, but now begins to hit top gear with two bends to go. Six stamps covers the entire field. It's Live in Lauren out in front here with six on the outside, followed by one. Then comes five. Space Jet finishing like an express train here up towards the line. A great champion. It's the mighty Space Jet. Well, the Premier Greyhound Racing Regency Final has produced quite a remarkable finish, and it's all about this young lady here. It is about Space Jet. Let's let's get in here and amongst the action, have a word first of all with with Matt Dartnell, because what we've witnessed out there was just probably even more magical than we could have expected. I watched it from the middle. I've lost my voice a bit, but I watched it from the middle, and I just couldn't believe what was going on. Like you had. You know, decent dogs battling out of the front, um, and her. Your other two. <laughs> my other two. You know, real good ding dong battle. Then she was lurking in the mist, and you know, coming home when Mark started shouting, I thought he must think he's going to win from there. And you know, he's never wrong, this man. So look, it's a great team effort. Thanks to Mark, Dad, Charlie. I mean, we're a small team. We graft hard, and Laura. and this bitch is Laura as well. And Laura, and this bitch here, she just put us on places that we never thought would be you know and to do the treble tv trophy the regency and the st ledger i mean that's that takes some doing it's one of those nights when you you know you you wish you were here and we were lucky enough to be here tonight to witness this and of course a one two three for you we shouldn't forget that as well exactly i mean i was just stood with the other owners there and they you know they, they they were just so happy with their dogs performances and it's it's, look, it's a lovely position to be in winning three semi-finals but put the pressure on for all the owners and great they had a great night all sat together near enough in the restaurant and everyone's wishing each other luck and you know and it was, it was lovely to be be here really and what a beautiful trophy i've loved this trophy for a long time i watched flying winner win this trophy and that's her grandmother you know so it's lovely to go back and win that it's great, it's great history look she, she's done you proud yet again and she's done you proud kern i mean she, she hello look, I'm, I'm brilliant i mean we, we are just so lucky to be here to be able to in, in, enjoy her and continue to enjoy it's a treat to everybody in greyhound racing um we're very lucky i think all the crowds love this bitch they love the way she runs and i just want to say thank you for corals for putting on a fantastic night's racing um and to the dartnell kennel who have been remarkable they've been remarkable and she's a treat nothing else to say really i can't say much more about it. Well, we we do run out of ways to describe her and and, and what, whatever she does whatever she's asked to do i mean to, to drop back to 695 for this event I, I actually said to the trainer this is the first time i dispute anything with you because i think it's too short he has just made me eat every word i could possibly say so there's nothing to be said I should point out of course you had the second as well I even forgot about that. <laughs> I'm sorry, Darren, and I'm sorry to the dog. Um, he's improved fantastically. And uh, yeah, for the kennel to have the first three, I don't know if anybody knows whether that's ever happened before, to have three in the race. Well, we need Pat Kelly or someone to get on to that. A word with Pat, Darren. But remarkable by these people, remarkable by this man and this bitch. And we'll never see anything like it ourselves. We won't, will we? We'll never see this in our lifetime, will we? No, I've, I've seen it, I've been with her all the way. And so very pleased and my well, words don't say what she means to me and her grand dam uh, broke track records when she was four and her dam broke track records when she was four so it's not the end yet not and yet. we'll leave that thought out there won't we well done well done to you all fantastic absolutely amazing Good girl.